Peggy 18. In terms of key new features for Dead Space 2, we really started from the controller and, and worked our way out. We wanted to make sure that everything about the controls were enhanced and improved. And that goes all the way to how quickly Isaac moves through the world, how responsive Kinesis is, his melee attacks, and his weapons. And another big improvement in terms of control for Dead Space 2 is the fact that in Zero G now, you'll actually be able to move in full 360 degree freedom, which is very different. In terms of, you know, the big question is, is it going to be too action-y? And the way that the team and I are approaching that is making sure that we don't lose sight of what made the first game successful with people that supported it. I mean, to be honest, without the people that were vocal about Dead Space, we wouldn't be making Dead Space 2. So to that end, we're not going to walk away from horror. It's very critical. It's a cornerstone of the franchise. And we're going to make sure that this game has equal parts horror and equal parts action. And hopefully will deliver a, an even better experience experience for people. Well, the team is just chock full of a lot of creative individuals. Everybody has things that influences them, uh, whether it's comics, movies, novels, TV, or just what they see around them. Personally, there's a lot of great movies that I like. One of the ones that, uh, in, in the horror genre that I really like is The Thing. And there's a lot of great games that uh, I've been playing. You know, recently, uh, as far as a uh, French game that I thought was awesome, uh, I really thought Heavy Rain was excellent. So there's a lot of different influences out there, and you know, everybody on the team has uh, different things they like. Hi, everybody. I'm here at Gamescom 2010, Germany. It's awesome at the EA booth right now, having a great time. Hope everybody's enjoying the stuff they're getting to see. See ya.